Hello, my name is Dr. Carlo Oger, emergency physician and founder of edexitvideo.com. The subject of this patient education video is abscess. An abscess is a painful collection of pus, usually caused by a bacterial infection. Most skin abscesses are caused by bacteria getting into a minor wound, the root of a hair or a blocked oil or sweat gland. Signs and symptoms of a skin abscess can include the following. A smooth swelling under your skin that can feel like a hard area or firmness. Pain and tenderness in the affected area. Warmth and redness in the affected area. A visible buildup of white or yellow pus under the skin in the affected area. A high temperature or fever and chills. A small skin abscess may drain naturally or simply shrink and go away. Dry up disappears, even without treatment. However, larger abscesses may need to be treated with antibiotics to clear the infection, and the pus may need to be drained. This will usually be done either by inserting a needle through your skin or by making a small incision in the skin over the abscess. The abscess is explored with a blunt object like a Q-tip or forceps to break off pockets and to make sure all purulence gets out. At this time, wound cultures will be taken in case complicated or resistant infection is suspected. Most medical health providers pack the wound with gauze. However, newer literature has shown that in most cases this is not necessary and can actually delay healing and increase the pain in the wound. The area will be cleansed and irrigated to remove most of the infection possible and to leave surrounding tissue clean and free of infecting bacteria. If your wound was packed, you will be instructed to remove it yourself in 48 hours or to seek the attention of a medical provider so that they can decide if packing can be removed, replaced, or left alone. Ensuring that your skin is clean, healthy, and largely free of bacteria can help reduce the risk of skin abscess developing. You can reduce the risk of spreading bacteria by washing your hands regularly, encouraging people in your family to wash their hands regularly, using separate towels and not sharing baths, waiting until your skin abscess is fully treated and healed before using any communal equipment such as gym equipment, saunas, and swimming pools. It is important that your emergency department visit be followed up by your primary care provider to re-examine you and determine if the wound is healing well as suspected. If you need any repeat procedure, change in medications, review the cultures that might have been done during the incision and drainage procedure in the emergency department. Please return to the emergency department if you are not improving as expected, if the infection seems to be progressing despite treatment, if pain is getting worse, or you feel you are getting worse in any other way. For other videos like this video, go to edxitvideo.com. But remember, these are educational videos and should never replace the care or attention of a medical health care professional.